is up glitter gang it is me your official glitter gal kitty danger and i am here today with a kawaii box unboxing they were incredibly kind to send me this for free to do a review for you guys so i am going to show you what is inside <laughs> i have my very fun like pastel blue scissors from target great resource if you want lots of cheap cute desk supplies gotta say okay pop this bad boy open packing tape is literally my worst nemesis here's a really fun story a cautionary tale for you guys uh, I once ordered a Lolita dress secondhand. It is my oldest piece I own. Um, Memorial cake, the white JSK with a ruffle on the front. I ordered that dress secondhand and it came like, and they covered the thing in packing tape. And so I was going ham trying to get this packing tape open. Ow. <laughs> Just like that. Um, I was going ham trying to get that packing tape open. And, um... I opened the package and realized that they had just put the dress in there without any bag or any kind of protection over it. And I came literally this close to like cutting the tool trim on the dress. So that was terrifying. Um, packing tape is my enemy now. All right. Yo, you guys are gonna see this before me. Ta-da! Is it cute? Is it exciting? I have no idea. Let's find out. Can you see it in camera? Okay, fun. So the first thing in the box is a little uh, flyer from Blippo Kawaii Shop that says that you can get a free kawaii gift with any purchase using the code KAWAIIFI. Okay, so we have the booklet. I have wanted a kawaii box for forever, so I'm really excited to finally have one of these. So the theme for this month is Neko and Inu, and I will go through this as we get into the box to see what is inside. I have no idea what I'm looking at right now. Okay, hang on. Okay, so we have, these are, oh my gosh. I think these are, yeah, they are a little cat toe bean gummies. It looks like they might be orange flavor, like orange and honey maybe, or maybe lemon and honey. I think, yeah, no, I think it's lemon and honey. That's so cute, they're little cat beans. And I think this is a lanyard. Oh, it is a Pastel Dream bottle strap. So if you have a um, water bottle, you can strap it into this. This is so cute. It says jelly beans on it. It has little gummy bears in it. I don't know if it'll fit my, my, like, at my school bottle. No, it's too small, tragically. I think it's for like plastic water bottles. That's okay. But yeah, you can hold water bottles in this and it's really cute. It says like, oh, it's Milk Joy brand and it says jelly beans all over it and it has gummy bears. <laughs> this is so blessed. Um, this is a little purse. It is a Kitty Pals coin purse. That's such a cute name. So here is the coin purse. It has little cats playing all over it. It kind of reminds me of Neko Atsume, if anybody still plays that game. Um, it's just a little plain coin purse on the inside, but it's pretty roomy. So you could put um, things other than coins in here. Like if you were carrying like a mini travel size lipstick and mascara for the day, you could put it in there. Oh, it reminds me of Neko Atsume so much. That's so good. This is, what are you? Hello. Oh, these are um, earplugs and case for if you're at like a concert or something and you wanna keep your hearing safe. My mom always told me to bring earplugs to concerts and I never did, so now I'll listen to you, mom, thank you. Mwah. So it has a little seashell on the front, which is really cute. And then if you unscrew it, I'm gonna try not to drop these directly on the floor. It has um, these little pastel lavender earplugs. That's so cute and it'll look nice in my bag. <laughs> that shouldn't be my first priority, but listen, aesthetic or die, okay? A, an ice cream puppy pen. Oh my gosh. Okay, I love collecting cute pens. And um, I literally, I have some of my favorite ones on my desk and I have this Pocky one I got from Daiso. So now I have another little friend for it. Oh, he is baby. These are, hello. It says carrot on it. What are you? Carrot candy erasers. 
It literally looks like a little candy pack. Okay, I'm never opening this. I know that they're meant to be erasers, but I can't open this. It looks like a little candy pouch. And it says, I like carrot on the back. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, no, I'm never, I'm never opening this. I'm keeping it. Have you seen those keychains that look like little pouches of candy and they're like squishies? I'm gonna like, I'm gonna like put a little keychain strap in this and like put it on my bag. That's precious. There is a chicken mochi shiva plushie. Oh, he's so round and he's a little orange. He's really good. He's so soft. Hello, baby boy. They describe him as having a pudgy, mochi-like body that is dying to be cuddled. I will cuddle him, and I will treasure him. I want to keep it safe. I will tell my friends and family about it. Um, Disney collect stickers. Oh my gosh, they're Monsters University themed. I can put them on my like school notebooks. And be like, hmm, they're university themed. Oh my gosh, look at the little milk chocolate. That's so cute. All of these are so precious, what the heck? My roommate and I have been planning, Zara, you've, I've talked about Zara. We're roommates now, super cool. Anyway, Hi. we've been talking about doing a uh, Disney marathon and, <laughs> they're so good. Okay, what else is in here? This is a cat coffee stand notebook. <sighs> it says fat orange cat on the front. It came a little bit wrinkled in the box because I think the box got kind of, tossed around a little bit in shipping as well as um so probably a little bit on me but that's okay but it says fat orange cat <laughs> It says in the notebook, um, or the little flyer thingy, wouldn't it be great if cats ran a coffee stand? This kawaii notebook brings that dream to life. Perfect for journaling or writing fantastic stories about cute kitties at a cafe. I'm gonna write a story about a cat at a cafe. It says keep writing in the front. That is so blessed. Oh, I really like how the pages are. Um, so they have kind of like a subject line and then the pages are divided in half in the middle with a slightly thicker line. I really like that they just include nice like simple notebooks because i i have so many notebooks i love notebooks but i always feel like i'm running out like i need a new one and if i just need a little small one I'm trying to drop the box then i have this things that made me smile it did make me smile <laughs> anyway okay that is everything in the box so yep so that is everything in the box so inside they have their cute little like branded t uh, tissue paper and the inside of the box is super cute as well. It says um, kawaii overload and then it says snap, share, smile. Share your unboxing twin kawaii mega box with a hundred dollars, hashtag kawaii box. I will, I will share my unboxing, thank you. <laughs> So yeah, that was it. That was my kawaii box unboxing with all of my amazingly cute goodies. Hang on, get them, get them all kind of in shot. So I can be like, look, here they are. Oh my God, I can't do it. No, my son, rescue him please. He's like, no, he fell in the little pen basket under my bed. Can you reach him? <laughs> oh, a rescue mission. Yes, my son. So this is kind of everything. Hang on. Kawaii box, yay. I thought this would be a fun, cute shot and then I realized how hard it is to get everything in my hands. But yes, this is my Kawaii Box unboxing. Thank you so much to these super wonderful, kind people who sent it to me. Um, and uh, thank you for watching to the end. I have a surprise for you, um, which you probably saw in the title, but let's pretend it's a surprise because it would make me feel better. So the people at Kawaii Box 
when they told me they would send me the box, they also told me that they would be doing a giveaway as a collaboration with me. So I don't have the link just yet, but it should be down in the description by the time I upload this video. So if you check out that link and do all the entries and stuff, you could win a kawaii box of your own. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Doodles.